Hello all, you're welcome to my channel. On today's um, tutorial, I'll be showing you how to make this lovely, beautiful bag. As you can see, it's got beautiful colors and this bag is going to take you just 15 minutes at most to get this done. So this is a DIY um, hand purse. It's so easy to make. So without wasting much of your time, let's go ahead and get started. So here I've cut out my pieces and um, I'm measuring 44 inches by 44 inches by um, 14 inches yeah like so so I'm going to go ahead and um, open the fabric and I'll be making use of the I'm going to mark out the center of the fabric so I'm going to draw a line there as an indication of the center of the fabric and I'm going to mark out I'm going to mark out 10 inches from there from the center like so so from that 10 inches so you're going to um, I'm going to go ahead and um, give it a line so you can it can be clear for you to understand <laughs> so after drawing this straight line I'm going to add uh, an inch and a half by the sides of the lines half an inch like so and I'm going to Roll it straight down. You can make use of your pen if your hands are not straight. You can make use of your um, ruler to make a straight line. So we're going to go into the process of um, um, folding the fabric. So this is a DIY, DIY fabric bag. Okay. You can as well use a hold to make it um, stiff, a stiffener to make it harder, but this is a fabric purse. So as you can see now, I have started folding the fabric. So I'm going using the lines to trace each pattern, each place, <clears throat> as you can see, just follow the direction as I fold it. And if you're having difficulty with what I'm doing, just go back and rewatch it again. Try it over and over and you will get it right. So from the center now, you fold, you fold the, sorry about that. You fold like so and let it meet the first line meet the center like so. Press it down to make it flat. Then from there, you fold it like so again. Then make sure you press it down. Then you fold the back fabric backwards like so. So you repeat the same step on the other side. So this is how I'm doing the other side. So this is it now. So this is what it will look like. This is what the end result will look like. So now that it's folded, I'm marking out the center of the bottom part of the fabric. And I'm going to mark, make an inch. I'm going to measure an inch from there like so then after measuring an inch from there I will now map, make a curve from that point so it will help make the back look a bit curvy the purse a bit curvy so I'm trimming it out like so So 
so if there are excesses excess at the sides you can and cut them out so I pinned the fabric down all the areas that I need to stitch I've pinned it down so that I'll it will be it will allow for ease when I'm sewing it so I've cut out um, pieces of this fabric this is um, this is four inches by an inch yeah four inches by an inch and I will be folding it like so I'll be folding it on bias and I'm going to stitch it like so after so folding it I'll stitch it like so so I'm going to use one two for the sides To create handle in case I want to add add um, the hand of the a hand to the bag. So from that center of the bag where I've created, this is where I'm going to go ahead and um, leave like I'm going to leave like four inches space there. To allow me to turn it inside out so I'm going to go ahead now and um, sew the fabric so now I've, I'm done sewing the fabric um don't forget to notch because what I'm doing right here is notching I'm notching and as well I am trimming off all the excess so this is what I mean by leaving a space that four inches space from that center so now I'm going to turn it inside out. I told you that guys, this bag is one of the most easiest bag to make. One of the easiest purse to make. It's so easy. Just one, one stitch is not like that confusing to do. It's pretty much straightforward. So I'm turning it inside out. So that means the right part, the right part of the fabric is going to be out. And I'm going to go ahead and use my <coughs> excuse me and use my um, scissors to um, push it all out to make it look um, nice and presentable if you want you can still iron it if you want however you want to do it to make it look more presentable So I'm going to stitch here like so because I'm done turning it, turning it inside out so I'm going to stitch it up. So now as you can see I have um, stitched it up and this is what it's looking like. I've stitched it up so I'm going to go ahead and create a buttonhole and also a hook for it. So that's what you do you add the the button into the fabric and um, stitch it around cut out the part that you need and then um, add it to the part that you want to stitch it to then sew it then stitch it yeah with your needle and thread
make sure when you're stitching it that the thread is not coming out from the other end of the fabric of the bag so everything has to be hidden your stitch your stitching has to be hidden hidden so now i'm done with this so i'm going to go ahead and make the hook so as you can see this is how i've made the hook i'm going to sew it So that is what this the hook is going to look like so now I've done the stitching of the hook and um, I'm going to go ahead and add some of my personal belongings into the bag so you can see what it looks like so this is the outcome of the bag I hope you like my video if you do why not subscribe and tell a friend to tell a friend and um, if you have watched this video to this end to this part it means that you really enjoyed this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up and um, smash the like button tell everyone to tell a friend okay and i'll see you in my next video Goodbye and God bless.